We're asked, what time is it? So first we want to look at the hour hand, which is the shorter hand, and see where it is pointing. So this right over here would have been 12 o'clock, 1 o'clock, 2 o'clock, 3 o'clock, 4 o'clock, and it looks like it's a little bit past 4 o'clock. So we are in the fourth hour. So the hour is 4, and then we have to think about the minutes. The minutes are the longer hand, and every one of these lines represent 5 minutes. We start here, this is 0 minutes past the hour, then 5 minutes past the hour, then 10 minutes past the hour. So the time is, the minutes are 10, 10 minutes past the hour, and the hour is 4, or it's 4, 10. Let's do a few more. What time is it? So first we want to look at the hour hand. That's the shorter hand right over here. It's at, let's see, this is 12, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and it's between 9 and 10. It's just past 9. So it's still in the ninth hour. It hasn't gotten to the tenth hour yet. The ninth hour is from starting with 9 all the way until it's right almost before it gets to 10, and then it gets to the tenth hour. So the hour is 9. And then we want the minutes. Well, we can just count from 0, starting at the top of the clock. So 0, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30. It's 9.30. And that also might make sense to you because we know there are 60 minutes in an hour. And this is exactly halfway around the clock. And so half of 60 is 30. Let's do one more. What time is it? So let's count. This is 12, 1. Actually, we can even count backwards. We can go 12, 11, 10. So right now we're in the 10th hour. The hour hand has passed 10, but it hasn't gotten to 11 yet. So we are in the 10th hour. And how many minutes past the hour are we? So this would be 0, 5, 10, 15, 20 minutes past the hour. That's where the longer hand is pointing. It is 10, 20.